YouTube, welcome in. How are you today? We are reacting to Maxor's new Genshin Impact video. Now, I know I'm late to the party. I know people have been getting their reactions out, but I'm going to be completely honest with you. Reaction content is very easy content. What did he say? Hey! Oh. And Maxor put a lot of work into this. And so my philosophy was I'm going to wait a little bit, like a month or something, so that Maxor can get all the attention and all the views for his video so that I can finally react to it and then upload it to my channel. Apparently it is okay with them. And everyone keeps telling me, watch this video. Did you watch the video? Watch the video. So we're finally watching the video. It's this new one called Genshin Impact is a playable anime. So uh, without further ado, let's just get into it. Let's just watch it. Okay, I don't know if I'm ready for this, this chat. This video is a, a cry for help. Genshin Impact is a playable anime. And that's pretty good. Since oh my, my God. This to make watchable anime. I can't believe it, guys. They made a sequel to Stockholm Syndrome. Welcome Dude, to- there's the a lot being thrown at me right now. <laughs> free advertising that I'm doing. A beautiful post-apocalyptic nightmare world featuring a giant tree. Uh, sorry, that's the wrong game. On our journey throughout the seven oh my nations, God. we will meet the my world's ADHD's most colorful like cast of children. Up. Entrusted and empowered by the gods to wield elemental energy as dangerously as possible. I'm just a big fan of the characters <laughs> of this game, but there's no reason in particular. Assemble your team of heroic psychopaths and begin blasting, boating, cooking your enemies alive, visiting Baby's first casino. And with enough time, it will become Baby's Bro, last casino. how long casino. did it take but him to make this video? Fun, because the game will try to stop you. I can assure you that the visual novels are exactly what Da Wei intended. So join me as I navigate one of the most beautiful, fantastical, and expensive game worlds ever made. One agonizing country at a time. This is it, guys. This is <laughs> okay. what $900 million can buy you. Are you having fun yet? Look, all I'm trying to say is... I don't know if I'm having fun yet. There's a lot. Right this is a good intro, though. I'm going to be honest with you. There's a lot being thrown at me right now. Oh, this is actually sick, though. Yeah, dude, this editing is insane. And it was edited by him. Dude, he's wow, talented. I haven't been here in uh, two years. <laughs> Welcome back to Mondstadt. And yes, the game still displays your IP address, just in case you're a little bit <laughs> too critical. This place is where the player learns how to fight, learns how to kill innocent animals, learns that they're yeah, bisexual as soon as they see Kaya. So I think it's a great opportunity to teach the basics and uh, nothing else. The environment here looks like it shares a polygon. I think a good place to start is with our team. <laughs> the Fuel Gunasaria. Official. Every crew got the schizophrenic. Personality disorder. Mentally and physically deranged. Wife material. Man, don't I'm, do uh, her like that. that. There's I mean, a question it's true. her mind and she fights her tulpa. End user license agreement. Literally the only physical DBS. Possibly racist. <laughs> has the biggest slappy in Teyvat. Sangin... <laughs> Sangin... Sang <laughs> and Rosaria. Who is slappy? Just I'm so calling her butt slappy now, dude. Garments. God, I wish nuns were real. With our team assembled, we would nuns are do nothing because I haven't explained the game. Genshin Impact is a based character RPG where each character wields one of the seven elements, all uh -huh. of them interacting completely nonsensically. Water buffs fire, ice freezes water, plants buff electricity, a fucking gas leak. Denger requires a, ga a gas leak. Khan Academy. My team is based on not playing the game as much as possible. There is genuinely no <laughs> cooldown to freeze. By the way, what I'm showing you now is considered tame. The game is actually supposed to look sub mentally deranged. The numbers are helping me to understand you what's sure, happening. Dude? Of course, some characters are bad, and others are very bad, but many are absolutely game-changing. There are characters that straight up allow me to fly, at least through yep. regular means. Hey, I remember doing that. Stick, and that this was one fun. doesn't fight at all. My cox crit rate is negative 87. The game also allows your us to what? choose from a lot of weapons. Did I think just I have a few copies. Cox? Each one with their own properties and substats. Sometimes too many substats. Like, goddamn, I'm fighting with a Wikipedia page. We've got bows, spears, bows, big fish, sentient umbrella, child's bomb instructions. I hope you can see why there's a lot of variation. And also theory crafting. A lot of Chinese theory crafting. They take this game very seriously. Like yep. right outside of a KFC seriously. And if you're wondering about the gambling, well hell, we'll get to it later. I have oh a lot to say about it. But for now, welcome to the land of the Anemo God, who is a twink that gets kicked in the balls. What are you This guy's a... Uh, really jamming out. No, chat. I'm not going to do that yoinky spoinky. Oh my god, he just doesn't give a fuck. So what if I just, uh... Oh no, he can't be I'm gonna stopped. have to bleep well, that, that part be, out on uh, the video. Monstead is a depopulated anarchist state where there are no taxes, no police, and half the country is controlled by wolves. Wolves that you uh, never actually see, unless you want to count Razor. I mean, there's the giant wolf, but he's kind of special. Uh... What the dog doing? As a result oh of this, nobody... This is just all meme. Money. 
Except for the church, of course. The city is undergoing a crippling wine epidemic. Look, I just think it's a serious funding issue when the cavalry captain doesn't have a horse. Therefore, most of your time is going to be spent cleaning up their mess. Their singular mess. Because there is only one enemy in Mondstadt. Yes, from the beautiful ruins I mean, we gotta to do something, of right? Spine, 90 percent of the enemies you encounter are Hillagerals, a sentient race capable of empathy and complex thoughts, which is why they must be destroyed. No, oh, I feel bad at uh, like killing Hillagerl now. Away from a Hill well, why is that one unbirthing itself? Really cool that the only organization in Mondstadt is dedicated to race war. They even have their own language, which I'm being quizzed on. Honestly, I'm a bit of a yay Dada man myself. Really feeling. Yeah, I click that one all the Don't time. Say Zito. It's basically a slur. They uh, didn't like that. Look, what I'm trying to say is this place has problems, but ultimately they are cool problems. Mondstadt may not be that varied, well designed, or even have a story that I can't summarize in one sentence. What do you the mean? Mondstadt's the best, dude. And then he was nice. Sun Tzu. But ultimately, this is just the beginning. <laughs> Not long, the Sun Tzu. Journey. This game is planned out uh, seven That's years good. in advance. So as far as the basics Sun go, Tzu. there is no better teacher than Mondstadt. But uh, pretty much just the basics. I don't think I'm staying for the boss fights. See, Mondstadt's my comfort what area. Happening. What the fuck am I seeing? Oh my god. <laughs> okay, can you stop playing for a sec? No. No. I need to go to my teapot! <laughs> okay. The leeway? Yeah. For the next stop on our War Crimes Tour of the Balkans, we're heading to the Funny Nation. Post about this nation to instantly gain Reddit karma. And for that, we're going to need to climb as high as we can so we can deduce the direction. Deduce so the direction. we're going to this location on the map. If only there was a better way to view the world. Make sure to land on the elevator. Next, we're going to, uh... Shit. We're going to. Uh, I tried doing that glitch and I couldn't get second. it done. We're going to ascend to space. I do. Uh, why does that work like that? Oh my God! The planets were so Celestia. I'm alone in this hell on Earth. I bet you when we go to Celestia, I I'm, that uh, I think I'm gonna that be here elevator will take us you there. You know, it's real bad when the moon is physically below you. Hang on, guys, it's getting kind of dark, so I'm just gonna. That's how high you quick. can go. Yeah, the game lets you do that. Well, folks, it was nice knowing you all. That's crazy, Never dude. Mind. Hey guys, Max are here, and welcome to, uh, China. It's just China. Zhaoshang Haoshang Wo, Shanzai, Woyo, Bing Chiling, Wuhan Shihuan, Bing Chiling. I really hope I didn't just tank my social credits. I was like, that sounds really familiar. He better not say Bing Chiling. Oh my god. So for Li Wei, we're going to learn that we've been playing the game wrong. But before I can get to that, I need to explain my team. I call it the hot shower by force. Lord knows we need it. Xing Zhi, Xi Jinping. Yes, this is a man. I know it's hard to tell. He is also ridiculously broken on account of his ability to make enemies wet. Interpret that information however you want. Hu Tao is the owner of a funeral parlor, and she could use a bit of new business. She is also the winner of the most terrifying Sims award. Like, the thread just doesn't end. He's still writing them. Most reasonable Hu Tao made. Yolan is a character that I play for the It was Yolan's Yola birthday today, she by the way. one of the most overpowered birthday, in the game, because she's a second Xing show. I don't even care that she's a federal psyop. I can fix her. And Toma. Uh, she's a better thing show. Spell really. wrong. Just, uh, just, just don't build Toma. With our team assembled, no! we are now able to Maybe. trivialize the know. combat because this team is ridiculous. But fortunately, Genshin is not just a game about combat. It's a game about gambling. You see, Genshin Impact is what we call a gotcha game because it has got me in its grasp. Does Maxor actually like actually play chance. Genshin or every no? Is chance. He's pretty every accurate. Is chance. Every piece of every build is fucking chance. Do you know what it's like to have a mathematically yeah, possible goblin? That makes sense. You have to be able to do this. So I see you're trying to level up your crit rate. Well, that's a weird way to spell defense. But fortunately, we can predict the outcomes of our character roles. <laughs> Using some Eastern philosophies, and the answer is up. Uh, Dude, how many times have we see Bing chilling in this Don't video? Worry. You've got a lot of time. Uh, I, I guess we're gonna wait a day. Because only a few five stars are actually available, and sometimes they aren't available for 483 days. She is in prison for racism. But what are they going to do? Lock me up? So naturally, we need to feed our gambling addiction at any cost. And there's a few ways to do that. You could explore more, go on fantastic adventures, or find amazing treasures. 
if you want to stay poor. It was no, a song, the Bible. Oh my quests, God. Which are a series of useful and normal missions, such as talking to people, murdering those people, talking to the Hillichurls, very nicely, finding the weasel. W where do you go? And ju jumping on mushrooms. Who the fuck commissioned me to do this? We also have the power to send very I don't know either. 20 hour expeditions fun. directly to the coal mines. Look, guys, I really need these two. How does he come up with this, dude? This is, dude, this is like. Greetings, traveler. Uh -huh. At Astra Abyssal. Okay. What can I do for you today? Yeah, I'd like to uh, send a child to the coal mines. What? Put her in for 20 hours. But, traveler, <laughs> she's going to die. The lithium is not going to mine itself, Catherine. But, but, traveler. Do not question me, Catherine, or I'll have you stabbed in a future quest. Too soon. Too soon. Way is an authoritarian militaristic oligarchy controlled by a committee of really hot lesbians. I believe in value <laughs> supremacy. This nation is the land of contracts, and by entering, you have made the contract to not criticize the state. Consequently, <laughs> Leeway is also where all money is printed on the planet. So, uh, I guess Monsanto's economy is powered by hopes and dreams, and also uh, the card game. Look, Timmy, I know your dad's dead and all, but do you want to play Gwent? A do you want to play Gwent? I know of it. Leeway is in the midst of a violent crime epidemic, as in the majority of enemies in Leeway are human, and even worse, they're poor. So poor, in fact, that they're forced to fight you with Molotov cocktails and farming equipment. What is what is your plan, my guy? The masculine urge to dig. He's a trying hole. to throw some By dirt the way, in your eye. The good guys. Speaking of digging holes, I should probably address this. It's a little difficult to ignore. You see, there are many beautiful places to see in Lee Wave, such as Night City, the fucking <laughs> Night City, the most annoying place to navigate on the Earth. Like, please stop giving me. Honestly, that's my least favorite part of Lee Wave, chasm, which is a secret underground labyrinth containing all of the game's elder horrors. And yes, this is just the entrance to the chasm. Yeah, there's no sound effect for that. If you die down here, no one will hear your screams. As soon as you think you're done exploring, it just it just keeps going down. It keeps going down. Yeah. The game so I can keep playing it. Now that we're trapped down here, we only have two options remaining. We need to mine and we need to craft. The second part will come later. Okay, so now it's later. Unfortunately, I cannot craft a sense of humor. Look, what I'm trying to say is <laughs> Leeway is a very diverse place. It's certainly more diverse than Hillichurl Field Number 6. But most importantly, Leeway is a land of questions. What secrets lie in this mysterious land? What adventures are still to be had? Am Dude, Leeway... It's almost Mondstadt is home for me, but Leeway's probably my favorite and, uh, area. Leeway might have a few issues with organized crime. Sea monster attacks. It happens twice. True. And the landscape always trying to kill me. But hey, at least the story's up. It's okay. Can anyone can anyone here tell me why... why why like there's a <laughs> why there's like a giant bird next to me it's weird oh fuck where am i <laughs> diagonally dude that part of the story was epic though dude my eyes are like What's burning <laughs> All right, Inazuma. Okay, guys, listen. We need to reach Japan. Don't worry. I have a plan to bypass immigration. We are going to walk <laughs> there. Yes, that's right. We're going to. Excuse me. We're going to travel underneath the ocean. So apparently, I just. <laughs> Under the up. sea. Uh huh. That actually worked. Okay, I think I've uh made a mistake. It's time to descend into the abyssal zone. Can you actually the walk there? The I thought it like brought you back what up. Do about this. So I think I've been walking for uh twenty minutes. Oh I wait, like yes, you more. can walk okay, there. You just can't now, sprint. So, uh, I remember. I don't think we're. I remember. You can't no, sprint. Please no, please no. I quit traveling there. No. Dude, that sounds painful. What is up, my thadies and gentle vamps? Welcome to the land of Inazuma, a home to nobody because no one is properly housed in Inazuma. Previously, I Monsen feel that too. To and Lee Wade taught us how to simp. Well, the land of lightning. Like, is who would want to live in Inazuma, honestly? Yet. But first, let's go over our team, which I will be calling the uh, Yandere Benzos. Yai Miko, Mommy, sorry, Sigma female, kidnapped a man and forced feminized him. God, okay, this video is already 10 out of 10 because there's persona music. Post to my Twitter.com. What the fuck are you saying? I'm gonna piss on the fucking moon. Bruce, you can literally <laughs> name 
named Bruce. That is actually how it appears in the game. In fact, we could name him all kinds of things, such as moon. Baby Girl, Dr. Ligma, Wobushidashogwa, Ballfart, Testicles. <laughs> what is that? And last but not least, Ball ball fart? Hatsune Miku. This is literally just Miku. Like, they didn't even try to hide it. Andrew True. Bennett, who is the single most overpowered unit in the game. Like, Genshin doesn't have power creep because of Bennett. Send this bitch to the coal mines and have his testicles exploded. Now, my previous teams, they were kind of nice. But this time, I am not playing nice. I'm nope. playing for funny numbers. Every single member is optimized beyond the boundaries of reason. I rolled six copies of Hatsune Miku, and now I can kill Tortellini in two attacks. It, uh, cost $50. Also, Bruce can, up uh, 50 fly. Like, actual flesh. I spent 200 for C6. They're just very confused. My entire team is him shooting down at the peasants like an attack helicopter. Just, uh, don't ask me how long I farmed for this. I had to grind for this view. Dude, his editing is top tier. This is actually crazy talent. Hang on a fucking second. She's wearing socks in the water. <laughs> Something is horribly wrong with this country. Inazuma is a third world isolationist dictatorship, mostly occupied by catastrophic disasters, both natural and man-made. But yep. mostly man-made. Me and the fellas watching Oppenheimer in the IMAX. Inazuma is also engulfed <laughs> in a decades-long civil war, resulting in mass unemployment and a refugee crisis. Naturally, this is reflected in the enemy variety, because to visit Inazuma is to be accosted by hundreds of jacked homeless people. Like these guys just- Jacked homeless people. How do the Hillichurls have more shelter than this? It is also a land of many islands, which all act as their own individual insurgencies. So I think I think this is a great opportunity to educate you as to why you should never visit Inazuma. You know, Honestly, besides, Inazuma uh, might be my least puzzles. favorite. This shit is the work of Satan. Narugami Island it's like is scary. It's always Inazuma scary. Resembling a civilization. The rest is basically just Martin Luther King Boulevard. The only disaster this island has to worry about is the government. And her name is the Raiden Shogun. Kanazuka is the first island to be made uninhabitable by nuclear weapons testing, which then proceeds to leak out of the elephant's foot in an amount so dangerous it makes Chernobyl look like clown college. I mean, I guess there's also the Kujo encampment, but uh... We don't go to the Gujo encampment. Mm mm. Well, that's enough of that. Yup. Yup. I'm minute. the same way. What the fuck? Yashiori is an absolute nightmare I don't know on account of the non stop lightning storm and uh slightly imposing giant skull. My favorite activity is uh, going to this place. It limits the land the light it can strike, so it just fucking whacks you. Looks like another beautiful day in the great land of Inazuma. Of course, I could this fix the problem so if I accurate, wanted to, but dude. when I began the quest to remove the lightning, I was struck by it. I'm gonna take that as a sign from God. Seirai Island is what happens when Mr. Beast donates 50 megatons of ionizing radiation to family Sadiq. Like, this shit makes Evangelion look like a comedy special. The fact that there aren't even homeless people here probably tells you all you need to know. Yep. Surumi Island is a very isolated place. Populated for thousands of years by bird worshipping savages who need their mineral resources exploited. President Biden, please send Raytheon missiles so I can oh. buy just Sony water and Cheetos. I just think it has something to do with the uh interdimensional dog. Watatsumi Island is really nice. Like, what the fuck? Honestly, yeah, it's like the island? nicest area. It's just so beautiful. I sure hope it's not hiding some kind of horrifying dark secret. Oh. Ankonomia oh. Is <laughs> fucking Atlantis. You get there by jumping into the giant hole, and it's like, how is this legal? Are the yeah. developers okay? This place was once home to a thriving civilization, which collapsed nearly instantly after they discovered TikTok. It also allows me to talk <laughs> about the us, powers yeah. of the artificial sun. And, uh, the holy shit, this 5G connection is crazy. Look, I think you've got the idea at this point. As much as I've talked about reactions and, uh, children, Genshin Impact at its core is an exploration game, because it makes you explore your sexuality. And that fact alone makes Inazuma one of the best areas. If you don't count the story, please kill me, mommy. True. I've been a bad boy and okay this nation might be lacking in housing i hate how accurate he is on bombed land but honestly that's just part of the rustic charm how else do you think this island got a giant crater just uh be glad you don't have to live in inazuma it's all fun and games until you piss off the geometry yep dude inazuma is just terrifying that's why i don't like exploring it i'm always scared hi guys it's me goro goro oh is that peanut butter <laughs> <What the> <laughs> What? Oh, it's me, Goro. Is that peanut butter? <laughs> That's how Goro sounds to me now. Going forward. Here you go, Edo. Eat All right, fellas, dog, for our next stop, we're going to enter the weed land. We need to smoke that Zaza and fall unconscious. And to do that, all we have to do is not be stuck in Inazuma. So True. if you were a fan of our undersea adventure, then don't worry. This glitch is much worse. All we've got to do is, uh... Whatever that was. I can't let go of the W button, by the way. Get ready to receive some holy spirit. Uh, okay, so we're just- What? Just I've never known about that glitch. We're going, to, we're going to Silent Hill now. Sorry, guys, it looks like we're uh, approaching meltdown. That's hey, crazy. Guys, me, Maxo. <laughs> uh, one second, guys, my mom's calling me. 
Uh, hey, Bob, w one second. I'm flying to get that Zaza. What does that mean? It means I'm low-key in a battle bus. Sometimes I wish you were normal. Okay, <laughs> where are we dropping, boys? Sometimes I wish you were normal. Perfect landing. Oh, good. Yeah, if, like someone said in chat, if you blink, you miss so much. I, I, I have to keep my eyes open. Hey there, my little genshits. Welcome to the land of Sumeria, uh, Sumeru. Hittite jump scare. The only nation in Genshin Impact that can use the internet, mostly for racism. Good to see that nothing's <laughs> changed. It is also um, absurdly gigantic, like the map screen can't even see all of it. But before we can get into the intricacies of Sumerian society, I have to explain my team. The, uh, the kindergarten. Nahida is... I can explain. My girl is 10, but she is 10. Nahida is the literal god of knowledge. If you count knowledge as the personal thoughts of every NPC in Sumeru, which she can read, even when I log into yeah, Discord, creepy. there's no escaping her. Oh my fucking god, they're still typing it. How many ebooks do these people have? Um, oh my god. Does watching you count as a hobby? What? I've actually been watching you for a long time. <laughs> Excuse me, what? Nilu has a completely hollow skull. There is nothing happening inside her head. She could not pass an eye exam. Sanginomiya Koko. Wait a minute. I've seen you before. But fellas, I've got something to admit. You see, Kokomi's damage scales on see, health. See, Max or is a bloom scales on health. And yes, even her health scales on health. So naturally, when it came time to build her, I um, used the wrong stat. It makes the numbers funnier. Yao Yao is very cute and muddy. Her play style is chill and relaxing. In fact, you don't even have to play as Yao Yao. You play as her artificial beast given life. True. It uh, throws vegetables at them. How many people would you kill for Yao Yao? <laughs> the Yao line. Not the, right question. the right question is how many people I would allow to live. Personally, I think this team is really good for yep. not having a DPS. And we are going to need it for all the funny and interesting events this game has to offer. Because, dear viewer, I lied to you. The best way to make money is not actually the Weasel minigame. It is participating in temporary event content, which I can only describe mm -hmm. as punishment for developers who are too insane. Event content such as Prop Hunt, a game where you disguise yourselves as various household Dude, items. Dude, I'm ready for that to come back. Very stupid people. Oh god, I think he's got a whiff. Wow, guys, this is just like Genshin Impact. Yeah, but I don't have to pay to see kids. You know what? I think it's about time that I show off my winning strategies. <laughs> Fellas, I've got a good feeling about this one. All we've got to do is, uh... Oh yep. my Next god, gotta, huh? Do this. He will never find me this way. D does he know? Oh I god, did that know. before! Wait a second, no. All right, fellas, I got a plan for this map. We're just gonna stand here. He has no clue. I, I can't. Why is it working like this? I'm sorry, guys. Looking up is really hard. I am torturing this man. You could say that, no he's way. A, that he's among us. We also have event content like the boat minigame. I'm having so much fun with the boat minigame. The Pokemon tournament arc. I, what is happening on my screen? Does that man have a fucking gun? The be beetle cockfighting. I've always wanted to beat a child. And my personal favorite, Chinese New Year. Because it makes me the most money. Just uh, don't look up any of the cutscenes. What the fuck? You know who, Tao? I think you've got some hidden talent. Please keep it hidden. That no. rap wasn't released. It fucking escaped. We didn't have to bring the rap into this, man. Kai, you gotta watch out, buddy. You're, you're fucking, you're rolling to the rag here too much. Honestly, he's Sumeru done a very good job of summarizing everything about Genshin. With a little hint of apartheid, governed by the worst organization imaginable. University. This nation is the land of knowledge, with most of it being devoted to new, more efficient ways to be racist. And to that end, Sumeru is segregated between two distinct parts, each with their own unique ways to kill you. The forest is a terrifying safari hellscape, where each animal is not only able to kill you, but is evolved to. We've got True. tigers, cows, crocodiles, robot dinosaur, f fungus dinosaur. Welcome to Jurassic Park. And my favorite <laughs> animal type, poor people. But most importantly, the forest is where the white people live, and they're filling the library with video essays. This is the Academia who controls Sumeru. <laughs> was one of the video essays the about the movie Raiden. Click? The Academia doesn't want you to know this, but you can <laughs> steal ducks from the public park. The, they're free, Raiden. The desert is a desolate, abandoned wasteland, once home to a thriving civilization. Before the Caucasoids built a giant wall between them. Does does anyone else think this is weird? We've got scorpions. We've got scorpions. Welcome to Jurassic Hell. We've got the, uh... Never mind. So is he gonna, like, uh...
Okay. And we've got worm demons. But my personal favorite obstacle not? is definitely the gigantic fuck off laser. There are, of course, even more enemies, but most of them are just liberal propaganda to make you believe that race mixing is a physical need. And fellas, it's working. But hey, the desert isn't all that bad, as long as you ignore the racist genie quest. Motherfucker graduated from casual to competitive racism. All right, later, Max. No, don't what? spoil it for me. I haven't done Wait, that yet. I gotta go AFK real quick. D no, you can't do this to me. Look, the point is, Subaru is massive, and it's not even done. And also, Leeway isn't done. And also, Mondstadt. Yeah. But what Subaru does have is an actually good story. Like, out of all the things I expected, True, it had, like, one of the best. Evangelion was not one of them. <laughs> you can't tell me what to do anymore, Mom. I'm finally inside of another man. Shady, what the fuck? I am the all-knowing god. Jesus Christ, they really made this boss fight. Mobile game, by the way. So whether you're exploring deep in the woods at 4 yeah. a.m., finding amazing oases, God, I sure hope nothing whimsical happens here. <laughs> fighting <Mer> <laughs> my boys, <laughs> I'm trying to be a police officer. Or doing the eight-hour gnome people quest. That is a... That is a lot of side quests. There will always be a new surprise in Sumeru. And if future content is even a fraction as good as this, then I'm going to be playing this game for a very long time. Because, you know, I wasn't doing that already. Yup. Oh, dude. This has been an insane video. He is, like, pinpoint accurate about everything. It's crazy. What the fuck? Sido? Sido, where are you going? This man is fucking tweaking out right now. <laughs> wow. <laughs> You know what, guys? Before I go, I want to give you all a fun tip that most Genshin players don't know. The Age of Consent is 18 years old. A shoulder for the past, but Oh my god. What a video. What a video. Uh, we have a link to the video in chat. Um, make sure to, uh, go watch this video, guys. Go subscribe to Maxor. Like, th again, this is just me reacting to it. I loved it. I hope you enjoyed my reaction. But please go give Maxor the view, the like, the subscription. He deserves it. That was insane editing. That probably took him so long to freaking do. And I'm just sitting here reacting to it. That was crazy, though. Like, at first, it was hard for me because it was just a lot being thrown at me, you know? But it got better, and he was so accurate with pretty much with, like, everything. I was like, Jesus. Wow. I'm glad we watched it. That was... Oh, my God. <laughs>